acknowledge what is yours philemon chapter 1 verse 6 that the sharing of your faith may become effective by the acknowledgement of every good thing which is in you in christ jesus the apostle paul here writing to philemon says he shares a very important key to the effective fellowship of faith you know when we as believers come together for fellowship one of the reasons we come together for fellowship is because we have faith common faith and so he says the communication or the fellowship of your faith can become effective or can be really productive if we do this by the acknowledging of every good thing which is ours or which is yours in Christ Jesus. To acknowledge means to recognize as a fact and it is usually expressed by what we say. So usually when, when we say acknowledge it implies we recognize something and then we say it, we talk about it, we uh, express it with words and what Paul is saying is you acknowledge every good thing that is in you because you are in Christ Jesus. That means you and I must learn to speak about ourselves, what God has made available to us, the good things that God has put in our lives because we are in union with Christ. So you and I begin to say things like this, we acknowledge things like this, I am the righteousness of God in Christ. Christ has been made unto me wisdom, righteousness, sanctification and redemption in, in Him. That is Christ is my righteousness, Christ is my wisdom, Christ is my redemption. And that's what the Bible says that in Christ He has become all this to us. You say that I who have received abundance of grace and the gift of righteousness, I rule, I reign in life through Jesus Christ. So what are we doing when we speak like this? We are acknowledging the good things God has made available to us or put in us because we are in Christ Jesus. So you begin to say that in Him I have redemption through His blood. That means I am redeemed by His blood because I am in Jesus. You say in Him I am more than a conqueror. In Him I can do all things through Christ. In Him I am complete. In Him I am partaker of His life. He is the wine. I am a branch on the wine. What's in Him is flowing in me. So you begin to acknowledge these things. And as we acknowledge these things, Paul says, our faith and our fellowship of our faith becomes effective, becomes productive. So this is something we must learn to do. For some of us, this may be new. You may never have been taught to do this. But here you are, you're learning what, what is there in Scripture. That the fellowship of our faith becomes effective by the acknowledging of every good thing that is in us in Christ Jesus. So acknowledge what is yours in Christ. Acknowledge the good things God has done for you in Jesus Christ. Remember, who you are in Christ is who you really are. Acknowledge that. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for all the good things you've put in our lives because we are in Christ. That you've qualified us to be partakers of the inheritance that you give to your people. Help us to acknowledge that with thankfulness, with gratitude. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.